Hello and welcome to CGTN Live. I'm Wang Tianyu. I'm Gong. And here we are at the second China International Consumer Products Expo. And we are now at the Hall 1. And this hall is all about the lifestyles. So uh, I can promise you that this pavilion is the most interesting one among the eight halls. And as you can tell, we are now at a safe skating court. So today we are going to bring you a closer look at this very fun sport. Yeah, look at us. We are all geared up. Yeah. Where are we going to try today? Uh, so I think I'm going to experience the surf skateboard for the first time. Have you ever tried it before? No, yeah, I never tried this before, but it looks just like the, yeah. the skateboard. I did try skateboard before, but it's not like the, the surf skate. So are you excited for this? I'm super excited. Yeah, so uh, today we're going to have you bring you a guest who knows this very well and also uh, experience the uh, experience this course by ourselves. And today we're joined by uh, Miss Chen. Thank you so much for joining CGTN. Yeah. So, uh, do you want to introduce yourself to our audience? Yes. Uh, so, such an honor, uh, such an honor to start the day with CGTN and these lovely two. I'm Yolanda Chen. I currently work as the head of marketing for our Timo Global Cell Phone Business. Yeah. Thank you so much. It's a really great honor to have you. But before everything, uh, Tim is going to try this for the first time, right? I got to buy my helmet first because you know safety is always important. Yeah. Sure. So as he's going to put on his helmet. Uh, Ms. Chen, could you tell us a little right. bit more about the sports? We saw there are so many people coming to your court. Yes. It's definitely one of the most attractive sports here at Hall 1. Right. So, uh, surf skating, as you can see, is it looks a little bit similar to, to skateboarding, right? Uh, it's actually one of the subcategories of skateboarding. And the origin of this uh, was for the surfers to train during off-seasons. I see. So as Tianyu has been ready for the sports, do you want to... Uh, <laughs> how, how do you feel now? <laughs> All right, I'm going to start it. Uh, is it like many people have been to the court? Oh my god, be careful! Uh, have been to the court, and uh, we noticed that's very popular, especially during the pandemic. So tell us about why, because we know uh, people can't travel out. Yeah. So why has it become so popular? Yeah, I would say the first reason uh, was because. Uh, skateboarding was listed as an official mm -hmm. in the Olympics. Mm -hmm. So that's how it became more known and known to the general public here mm -hmm. in China. Uh, that's the first. And the second is that because of the all-time you know, Winter Olympics uh -huh. and the all-time legend, which who is also our uh, Chinese pride, mm -hmm. Ailing Gu, Gu mm -hmm. Ailing. So uh, it's really because of that that this sport has become known to uh, more and more people and I all see. the skiing and stuff. So, but because uh, when Winter Olympics ended, it's already it was already the off season for snow for mm -hmm. snow season. So, uh, what can we do? So th those people who could not actually go skiing, yeah. they uh, use this as a replacement. I see. Yes. So Terry, you are back. How, how does it yeah. feel like? I think I'm okay with it. You want to have a try? Uh, yeah, I'm going to put on my helmet. Okay, go, yeah. go, go for it, go for it. Uh, so Ms. Chen, uh, I, I want to ask you that, uh, what do you think is the biggest uh, difference between the surf skate and uh, skateboard? Right. I would say there are uh, two differences. Uh, first is that it's more accessible, easier, a lot easier to get on. So it's easy for it's easier for beginners to get on the sport. Okay. Right. And the second is that you see the little things that do the tricks here. It helps you to gain the moves and the spins that uh, we do in the real surfing. So it can bring back the same kind of fun that surfing and skiing uh, offer you. I'm gonna tell you my feeling. I think it's more uh, flexible than the skateboard because you, you I can feel that I, I'm gonna use the, the central part of my body oh, to, right. to control okay. it. Ah yeah, I see. I, I think that's why it's called surf skating, right? Yes, yes. And and actually these days you see a lot of people uh, doing the surf skating on, on the streets, on the Chinese streets. Yeah. I, I think she's ready. Let's go. Okay. Let's see oh, <laughs> how wow. she's gonna try it out. <laughs> okay. I, I can tell I'm very excited now because I'm going to try the surf skateboard for the first time. And I'm joined by Ms., uh, Mr. Wang, uh, Wang Jiaolian. It's a really great honor to have this. And uh, he's very experienced, as, uh, as you can tell. Uh, so um, I'm very excited. Could you tell me how to uh, step on? 
你是刚刚是右脚去吗？啊，对。对，那你就对，我们只有四个。There are four kinds of the points, so we have to step on this point and then、uh, to put our feet on that. 然后，然后我们的脚站在肩膀宽。哦，要肩膀宽。And I also got to stand a little bit wider than your shoulder, so uh, to to keep the balance. 放松，放松。Actually, very nervous. Okay. Oh, we have to, we have to, we can't relax. So, Tian, you tell tell me how to move forward. 就我们放松下来，放松 ，OK， 先放松，然后眼睛看前面，然后我会给你一点点速度 ，OK， 然后你的脚就是看我教你的转弯那样 ，OK，OK，Sure，、okay. okay. 往前走， okay. 你就把它想象说我们无限的在往前转弯 ，OK， 要转不转，要转不转，要转不转那种感觉。If you want to start, you're gonna use your your, your, your left foot. My coach told me that I have to uh, to go easy. 我帮你拉过去。Uh, so I have to move my feet uh, forward and then I'm、uh, yeah. still a little bit nervous. Down, down the head, we're going to down the head. Relax, relax. Come on, this side, come on, this side. Down, down, down. Down, down. So when you turn around, you. Down, down, down. 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 Down, 膝盖用力，腰要直，腰要直起来。对，好，我们先膝盖做动作，放松一点。好，那你会发现你会快一点。好，来，腰还是转不动啊？你要压，啊压，有速度的时候，我们膝盖弯起来。OK， 就掌法不一样的感觉。OK， so we got to put our knee down and try to when we make a turn. 好，我们把这个背个步的运动啊，我们现在稍微改造一下它。啊，可以，可以走吗？可以，可以。How did it feel? Yeah, yeah, it feels very good. Come on, come on, come on. It feels very good. It's very, very difficult to make a turn now, but it's good. Okay, let's go. Yeah. 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 Let's go. Yeah, I'm making it. Uh, I'm turning around on myself now. Yeah. 再过来一点，再过来一点，再大胆一点，对。好，来，你们这边给点点位置。好，来，大胆往这边压，压过来，眼睛压过来，对。Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. I'll call it a day now. Thank you. Thank you so much. Interesting sports. It's my first time. How, how does it feel like? I mean, you've been doing some skateboard you before. You <laughs> you've been doing some uh, like this kind of sports before. How does it feel? What's the difference? I, I feel like it's more, you know, more flexible than the skateboard. Mm -hmm. And I can tell that uh, you're gonna use uh, the, the central part of the, the, the abs. <laughs> you're gonna use your abs. Yeah. yeah. So why don't we just? Let our coach yeah, to show us so some professional could, moves. Yeah, we'll give you a free but professional show from our coach and let him show how he really likes, not like ours. But uh, yeah, I'll go talk to him. Okay, okay, show time. Oh wow, it's quite different. It's like a, it's another sports. See how smooth he is. I'm very jealous of him.
So how long have you been trying to play with the the surf skate? Uh, I got one. Surf skate. I was two years. That before was. I was skating eight years. Okay, so he's he's saying he's saying that、uh, he has been playing the the skateboard for eight years, but、uh, surf skate for only two months. Only two months. <laughs> Yeah, thank you so much.、Uh, so thank you, our coach. So,、uh, Yolanda, I still wonder, like, it has been a sport, just like you mentioned, because of the travel restriction, because、right. of、uh, we can't go skiing. So, do you think the popularity will sustain? Yeah, I definitely think it will sustain、mm -hmm. because、um, I think these days, young generations and. Uh, actually, it's not just limited to young generations, but like people of all ages. We want to find something that's more predictable,、mm -hmm. something that's more reliable,、uh, some of the nearby fun. So actually, we did a campaign before called "Finding the Nearby Fun,"、mm -hmm. 找回附近 So I think I think this way of lifestyle will definitely carry on. Yeah. So I also noticed that like we play more badminton or some very easy but fun sports、right. during the pandemic as we can't go outside. Yeah. So、uh, I guess this kind of simple but very fun sports will be like a, become a lifelong、uh, sports for us, especially、yes. the, the, the young generation. Yes. People all want something that's affordable, that's more accessible,、mm -hmm. uh, so that they can easily pick up the fun at any time. Yeah, sure. Thank you so much. Thank yeah, you thank you so much for having、CGTN. me. Thank you so much.、Yeah. Okay. Bye. Getting my gears off. All right. So、uh, let's let's just move to our next booth, and、uh, which is what I'm very expecting about is the NBA's booth. And、uh, a couple of days ago, I went to an NBA basketball school in Haikou, and that is the only one、uh, NBA China basketball school in China. And I'm very surprised that a lot of kids, a lot of young kids, high school students, middle school students, have all gathering there to have the, the summer camps, the, the tournaments. I, I, I'll just wait for my colleague Dawn, and she's gonna catch us up. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's move. Let's move to to the NBA. Yeah. So, can you? What's our next station for live streaming? Oh,、uh, it's NBA definitely, and、uh, so we're gonna go there and see what kind of, you know, the what kind of sports that we can do there. Yeah, so it's it's quite very interesting, very relaxing a whole because there are all kinds of sports and they're showing the very latest trend of lifestyle, especially during the pandemic. I play tennis and、uh, a volleyball in middle school, in middle and school?、Uh, uh, badminton and table tennis. I'm, how how good you are? Ah,、uh, I'm I'm fine. What about you? Do you love tennis? I do tennis, but I'm not very good. I'm、mm -hmm. I'm bad actually. Okay. But, but recently, I was falling in love with the, the stand up paddle boarding.、Uh, it's a sport from Hawaii, and you just stand in the board,、uh -huh. and you have a one side paddle.、Uh -huh. And you move it just like a. And you play it in、room. Beijing, right? Yeah, in Beijing. Yeah, and then as we're showing you,、uh, there are different kinds of bowls, and then it's very luxurious, right?、It's、super fancy. I hope I own one. Yeah, and then, as you can tell, there are many people here in hall number one showing. I guess it shows that whole people are fascinated by all these very different kinds of lifestyles. Yeah, that's why I say it's the most interesting one.、Mm -hmm. Of course. So、uh, this is your second time. Oh, there are also cars there. They're they're fancy cars. <laughs> It is fancy cars. How do you know that I love fancy cars? Yeah, which one? Which one? Which one is your favorite? Oh, I prefer SUV. You prefer SUV? Yeah, I prefer SUV because I I want to go out.、Uh -huh. I I want to you know embrace the nature. So、uh, SUV is definitely the the best model for me. I see. Like, Uh, yeah, me too. I think especially during the pandemic,、uh, that people try to、uh, drive their car old and then to go camping. I think camping,、okay. especially at the backstage of their、uh, their car, has become a really trendy、uh, way of going out, and enjoying themselves. Yeah, but you gotta have enough money to buy a SUV first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of course. And there are so many people here. It's the second day that it has、uh, opened to,、uh, I guess, professional visitors. Yes. And then、uh, we're still welcoming a lot of people. And I think it's, it's actually a very difficult thing,、uh, especially、uh, there are so many uncertainties coming from both home and abroad. 
Yeah, I think so. Because uh, I, you know, I came here uh, mm -hmm. last year. So oh yeah, it's your second time here. It's my second time here, and uh, I can tell you that uh, this time I see more people, mm -hmm. and I see the, the you know, the, the pavilions. There, there are more pavilions, I think, mm -hmm. and uh, also the the exhibition area is bigger. Mm -hmm. And, and I, there are more brands, right? There are more brands, but. Uh, also, a lot of brands are actually the same from the first year, which means that they, they came here for the second time. Mm -hmm. And I will share with you a little story. Yeah. That um, last year I uh, I have interviewed uh, uh, Hong Kong exhibition area, uh -huh. and uh, I was interviewing there. And their exhibition booth is uh, a little bit small, but this year it's like 500 square meters. It's very very big. Also, I, I talked to some RCEP exhibitors. They also have a, a like t almost twenty percent increase of their exhibition area compared to the first Hainan oh, Expo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So great. definitely very attractive. And now we have come to Sanrio. We have come to Sanrio. Tell you, I mean, you may not find it interesting, but it's like a childhood dream for uh, for me actually. So uh, Sanrio this year had their first time pop-up store at, uh, at the Hainan Expo showing the Japanese uh, brand uh, presses here. <laughs> and <laughs> very, very lovely audience here. Thank you. <laughs> and uh, can you, I'll give you a tour inside the Sanrio place. Yeah. So uh, here's one of their icon dog here. And uh, oh, it's I, dog. I, I thought it's rabbit. Yeah, it's a big ear dog. And I like I like a lot when I was very young. <laughs> As you can tell, there are many kids here. I think we very enjoy the, the company with our uh, childhood Hello Kitty and also uh, other images. I don't, yeah, it's like amusement park. So I think it shows the diversity of the Hainan Expo that it's not only the top-notch brands, international, but also this very familiar childhood. Uh, uh, Your like, childhood. Yeah, my childhood. Very cute. Come here later. Yeah, of course. I'd love to buy, uh, <laughs> to buy purse and everything from here. Here we go to the NBA booth. It's right there. Yeah. Very close. And then we're heading to uh, your your area. My area. <laughs> area. Still, this the place is very pinky and. Uh, I think it's very attractive and it's also the first time Serial has such a pop-up store here at the Canada Ice School. So uh, there are also different uh, consulting firms, right? Like they're holding uh, TWC or they're holding their uh, booth here. Very, very diverse. Yeah, and uh, today we're going to have a uh, green consumption forum talking about sustainable development. Later. Yeah, so um, I think sustainable uh, sustainable growth or green consumption has also been a very mainstream topic, not only at the Planet Expo, but actually through many uh, forums and events, because it's been a trend. Yeah, it's a big task in China now. Yeah, of course. And now we are uh, coming to the NBA court, which is also very exciting. Can you tell us more about the place? <laughs> You know, I, I do like playing basketball, but I'm I'm not that professional. And uh, w what I can tell you is, uh, my team is Pacers because I went to college in Indiana. Oh wow! And my school has you know a lot of NBA players. Yeah, we also have a guest here, uh, Mr. Liu. Thank you for joining CGTN. Hello, hello. Hi, Hi guys. Uh, so this is. Uh, the NBA China Marketing and Communications Manager. So, you want to say hi to our audience? Yeah. Hello everyone. So, so could you tell us uh, what what you brought to this second China Expo? Yes, uh, we have a collection area, an interactive court, and a retail space. So people people can come here to take photos with, with NBA champion trophy, NBA champion rings, and an autographed Kobe Bryant jersey. After this, you can go to our interactive LED basketball court to shoot some hoops, and then. Get some your favorite NBA stuff from our retail space. Let's go for it.
可以可以可以，怪不得加强过阵风。好，那就是我们接下来玩的游戏呢，就是找不同。我们将在到哪个场给出来自凤指窝间的两张图片，当然当中有五个不一样地方，你只要找到三个就可以拿到我们的礼品。只要找到三座，请每一位我们有。The, the, the main interactive area can't be open to us right now, so we're going to experience another a VR. Uh, it's, a, it's an AR. Uh, it's, a, it's a mini game with some AR feature that you can. You can really use your body to uh, to collect some points with a with a virtual basket. Uh, should we try it? Should we try it? Just raise your right hand. Yes. So Tay okay, is going to give a shot at this. Yeah. 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 There might be some interference from the from the from other audience. How do I move? I just move left and right. Yes, just move left to right with your body. You see? Oh, okay. Yeah. So congratulations, three points you have. Yeah, you only have three points, and I'm going to give a shot. All right. I got a three. I got a three. You don't, you don't move your body too much. That's when you, 对，可能会挡到。对 ，OK. Oh, you're better than me. Yeah. Just slightly move left to right. Oh wow. You already, you already triple the points, Tian. You got. Oh, come on. Oh, you got someone blocking your view. All right. 16. All right. All right. Are you interested? Actually, yeah. I'm so embarrassed. So embarrassed. I also wonder. Is there any like new trends that you have observed? It's very noisy here, so. Yes. Um. Yeah. So. I just saw a lot of people getting online. You see a lot of people getting online. Why are in interactive basket boards with all those LED features uh, built in? Because young people like to uh, have experience. Not only shooting basketball, they want you know cool features. They want to have visual effects. They want to you know innovative uh, features built into the traditional basketball. So we 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 hope this can really help uh, attract people to participate in basketball and uh, uh, help them build up their uh, body strength and have a, a very uh, positive lifestyle. NBA came here last year, yes. and uh, what is the difference, basically? Uh, the difference is we have this, uh, our entire exhibition leveled up. Because last year we observed how people like to play basketball. So this year we have larger screen, better system to give people brand new experience playing basketball. Just to, uh, our goal is to make more people participate in these sports. So watching sports, can be very inspiring. A uh, playing sports can help them build a stronger body. So why not? Thank you. Thank you. It's very insightful, and thank you for thank joining you. us. Thank you for coming. Yeah, thank you. So, Tianyu, oh, we're heading now to our last station of this uh, uh, live streaming. Yeah. Tell me, what's that? It's my favorite one because we <laughs> we did some sports right here, and uh, what we're gonna do is uh, a massage arm chair. Yeah, a massage chair, I think. Uh, so, you have been working hard for in these couple of days. Yeah. I think you also need a rest. Of course. So, for our last station of this uh, live streaming, we're heading to a massage chair. Yeah, it's called Awesome. The workout is called Awesome. It's from Singapore. Yeah. And then uh, we can have a really nice, relaxed there. Oh, I can't wait. Let's go. Yeah, sure. So, uh, here. Hello. Hello. 
你好，我们是那个 CCTN 的，然后直播，然后想现在就是能不能让我们体验一下这个椅子，然后做一个简单的介绍。So we're asking if you can have an experience on the latest product, the new product. 呀，能帮我们介绍一下吗？谢谢。Oh my God! There's so many people. Yeah, they're full of people there. <laughs> so you want to know how popular it is? This one? Do you want me trying this first? Go first, the lady first. Okay. So, oh, so, 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 uh, yeah. Yeah. So this. Uh, this Actually, their uh, new product, and then uh, very different from the previous one. This one can first test your uh, pressure level, and then try to uh, de de decide like w which kind of massage you need. So I'm going to give a shot. Yeah. And then, uh, from what I know before, uh, the, the Singaporean brand has been uh, one of the uh, exhibitors from RCEP countries who has been actively taking part uh, at this year's Hainan Expo. Everybody? Put your hands on the chair. And then it will test your stress. See how much, how much stress you got. Don't move, don't move. You got a lot of stress? So I'm asked you now to move my hands. You actually, you don't have to close your eyes. <laughs> it's very comfortable sitting here after, you know. So I have to put tight on my hands on this side. Do you want to show? Do you want to show the screen of my pressure? I'll let you know later. It's gonna take 20 seconds. Don't move. And it's testing your heartbeats. You know, last time, last time I tried this out, I was like 59. Yeah, and over 60, is, it means high stress. And you're like very relaxed. Okay. Uh, so while I'm taking off my shoes, do you want to give a tour of all these chairs and then I show sure, sure. you? Uh, see, see how many people are here to try this. Uh, you know, massage armchairs. See how comfortable they are. This man looks already fall asleep. All right, I think she's gonna start it. Yeah, so I think I'm ready for a massage here. 那跟我们讲一讲就是说这个按摩会有什么样的这个具体的它其实我们给它叫多感官的一个放松方法它现在给您做一个肩颈的一个肩侧因为每个人的体型是不一样的那它现在的屏幕是帮你做肩颈肩
can actually adjust the different level and the intensity from this uh, uh, the screen and the, the wind that I've already So it's already started? Yeah, already started. <laughs> it's really nice after you know doing the surf skating board and also playing the basketball. It's a really good relax. I want to call it a day. I really call it. Tell us how it feels. I can see that it's moving. It's very surprising because you can, you know, relax your fingers. So it's actually a very, uh, it's very comprehensive. It's from your hands to feet and then uh, to your whole touch. Yeah, it's very comfortable. And then, uh, uh, it's uh, 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 so she's saying that uh, for for the both the second, first time and the second time they brought some new products in Hainan Expo, and uh, this one is actually the best one. Yeah. Yeah. So are you going to release? Uh, 就是你们会还有新的产品吗？然后这一次有什么新的呃这个展秀展的产品呢？这一次有另外一个，就是我们这个叫养生系列。那这个是最高端旗舰的产品。那另外一个是我们在呃今年的新款，就是目前在台南测博会首发跟首展的，这个叫减压养生饮。那它其实从产品设计可能到产品的价位，可能都会有一些区别。哪个是减压养生饮？这个这个这个对。This was actually released last year, and this one is the new new one. Okay. 然后它是跟意大利的设计师一起联名设计的，那它是有一些跑车的元素，呃，对，宾尼法尼拉设计师工作室一起一起研发的，对。Italian designer. The tour around this hall. She says some characteristics of the sports car. Imagine if, uh, imagine that if you own one of these chairs in your home, and after every day that you hard work, you can come back to home and you have a chair. How enjoyable it is! Special series of the chair is called uh, for the gaming chair. Yeah. Well, it's not just gaming chair, it's actually a combination uh, of gaming chair and uh, the massage chair. And tell us something about, about the chair. The 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 I'll try this one. And go on, you go for that one. Oh, oh. My back. And then they have different buttons here to uh, adjust the uh, uh, the intensity and also the mold. And there are essentially there are uh, two very little cute things that is hit on my back and waist. 一百四十五度，对，然后可以直接往后躺，一百四十五度，对对对，然后你如果不按的话，就把它撑回来就好了。然后这个也可以把它调高调低的，因为每个人的身高体型不一样，像我比较矮，腿比较短，我就放低一点
Uh, not really. What about you? Play some time, then, you know? It's pretty cool that you, you play for three or four hours yeah. <laughs> after you you know you play games overnight, it's and then you got to some relax, and you, then you go back to the game yeah, <laughs> again. Of course. It's very considerate because they usually you usually play for a long time, right? I, I, I do sometimes. Oh, Transformers. more that we didn't try out uh, but, but uh, you know time is up so I think we're gonna just stop here and uh, yeah. later on we have more uh, reports or coverage that we will bring you about the second Hainan Expo. Yeah so for anyone if you're at the Hainan Expo if you're interested uh, come to hall number one to experience all these very fancy uh, also fan sports and different, uh, different types of uh, relax or go subscribe our, you know, just go subscribe us on any uh, any social media platform that you can imagine, yeah. Facebook, Twitter, Weibo, YouTube. Yeah, and also we have an exhibition area at uh, Hall Number oh, yeah, 5, Oh yeah, Hall right? Number 5, yes, that's so, our uh, studio right there. you're always welcome to come and then uh, give us feedback for have a face-to-face -face communication with CGTN. Alright, it's time yeah. to say goodbye. Bye, see ya. Bye.